Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are actually going to be building something brand new. This is going to be a quick build video, if you guys haven't seen a quick build video before. Essentially, I try and complete the exact or the entire thing today in one video. So, what I wanted to do today was actually build a... I guess it's a float plane, I'm not entirely sure what you'd call it. Uh, but it is an N3N. Uh, it's a biplane with three floats. So, that's what we're going to attempt to build, uh, or at least something like it, um, and we're going to go from there. So, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Uh, I think by the end of this one, I'll try and upload it to the workshop straight away so you guys can mess around with it, and we'll see what happens from there. But let's get on with it, shall we? <laughs> Okie dokie, so we're in the hangar. Let's start building. I, I don't know how this is going to go, I'm not entirely sure, but let's just, let's just see. So, I want to start off with the engine at the front. Obviously, that is where the engine needs to be. So, we're going to go ahead and put these pieces right here. And we're going to start building the engine in. A uh, bit weird, but there you go. In fact, actually, no, delete these. We'll have it go in from the start. There we go, excellent. Uh, we'll then put one in the middle, and we'll do the same thing around the outside. So there we go. We'll then put one in the middle, excellent, and that's all good. We're actually going to go ahead and seal all this off, except the middle piece, and we're going to put a pipe straight in there. So, if you're wondering why I'm doing this, uh, essentially, this entire piece is actually going to change colour. It's all going to be greyish, I guess? Yeah, somewhat like that. So, this is going to be where, like, the cow flaps are, I guess, uh, and the engine is going to go sort of behind it, if I can. Um, so, there you go. We're going to try and build a modular engine as well, which makes things a hell of a... things... Uh, there, there. I can't even speak. Uh, which will make things a lot more interesting, I guess. Anyway, propeller. Let's go with this. Here we go. Propeller and... Oh, there we go. Yeah, no, that's cool. Uh, and what we can do on there, to make it look a little bit more interesting, is we can actually add these bits. There we go. So we can actually add these bits to there. I don't know whether these are going to be spinning. Uh, is, is a thing. I'm not sure if they do spin. But there you go. That's going to go on there. Looks a little bit interesting. Looks okay to me, I suppose. Um, so... There you go. Um, also, I'm just going to go ahead and paint a line down the middle. And I'll also paint, I guess, some edge pieces. Like this bit and this bit. There you go. So when it's spinning, you can actually see that it's spinning like that, which is interesting. Um, do I need to put this on the other way up? I'm not sure. Like that? Should, should it be like that? I'm not sure. I don't know. Uh, it's only going to be two blades, I think. And blade length can actually be huge, I guess. There you go. Yeah, that works. That's fine. Okay, good. So, we're now going to build off the back of that and hopefully make it look lovely. So, let's make it yellow, yellow, and build it onto there. So, this is going to go in here like so. Excellent. We need to do this on both sides. So, there we go. Very nice. We're then going to do the bottom, bar, bottom bit too. So, like that. There we go. Excellent. And seal this bit off. Yeah. Okay, so far, so good. Looks lovely. Actually does look lovely. That's good. Um, so yeah, I like that. Uh, we might actually do more to that, but I like it being sort of squared off for right now. I think that's okay. So, now what we're going to do is we're actually going to go ahead and attach this piece to right here. Because this is where uh, the start of the wings are actually going to be. Which might be a bit weird, but I'm sure it's fine. Uh, we're also going to add the little... I was going to say cockpit. It's not really a cockpit. Um, but yeah, the bit where the pilot sits. I guess it is a cockpit. What am I talking about? There we go. The cockpit's going to go in right there. And that should be fine, I think. Maybe. I don't know. The wings are going to go on top of this, obviously. And some of the wings are actually going to go down and backwards. So we're going to build this in so that we can fit at least one person. Obviously, it's going to need to fit two because that's how planes or these planes work. So, yes. There we go. Excellent. We're going to add our first seat. Let's do it. Seat is going in. We're going to make it a pilot seat. That's a good idea. Because uh, the pilots will be able to fly from there. That's that's excellent, actually. Uh, we're going to make this, I, I guess, like, brown. There we go, because I guess it should be. Uh, and it's going to be quite low in the cockpit, which I think also makes sense. So I'm happy with that. Uh, we're then going to delete this bit, this bit, this bit, this bit. And we're going to make it yellow again. Actually, maybe we shouldn't. Because if you guys have seen, like, other planes and stuff, let's go back to this brown colour. And we'll actually put this bit right here. There we go. And we'll actually paint this bit in. Yeah. Okay. Because I think that that actually somewhat works. 
which might be a bit weird to a few of you guys, but I think it works. Right, parachute is the next thing. I know this probably shouldn't be involved straight away, but it is. So there you go. Hey, anyway, parachute's going to go straight in right here. It's going to be for the front person. Oh, uh, what's happened to my camera? <laughs> uh, and that'll be fine. Very nice. Very nice indeedy. So there's our front seat. I think that works. We then need a, a second seat. So we actually build up a bit of a barrier here. Uh, because we don't want them talking to each other. You know, that would be bad. Let's fill that in. Bring this up to here. We'll actually have a bit of a barrier just like this. And we'll fill all that in. There we go. Tiny little barrier. Then the other person can then be seated. And they're going to get the exact same treatment, actually. They're going to get one of these. There we go. And then they're going to get one of these. Just like this. There we go. And they're going to get one of these, just like that. There we go. And we're going to paint it all in the exact same way. Is that weird or what? I think it's fine. I think that's probably... A, uh, should we paint all of it like that? I'm not sure. Actually, delete these ones. There we go. I think that works. I think, I do think that'll be fine. Very nice. We're then going to paint all the inside. It's like leather. That works. And then we're going to build this in. Yeah, look at that. Would you look at that? It's looking brilliant. It is looking brilliant. Okay, so seal all this off like so. Seal all this off like that as well. So what we're going to do is the rear wing is actually going to go down here. It's not going to be super big, but it is not going to be super tiny either. So we're going to build it in just like this, I guess. Bottom wing, going in. I don't know how wide or long it should be, but I'm not very good at those things. I'm sure that's fine. Uh, we're actually going to go ahead and attach this piece to here as well. Like that. And honestly, I think we're actually going to do that. And maybe even this. There we go. Yeah, no, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. It seems fine to me. <laughs> Seems fine to me. All right, you seal that off, um, but not quite like that. I don't mind if there's a bit of a gap looking weird. But that's fine. There we go. Delete these ones. Put it in there and fill this little bit in. Excellent. That is starting to look lovely. Yes. Okay, good. So second seat is going to go in now because realistically we need it to. Uh, we're going to get ourselves a parachute. We're going to put it in, uh, but we're going to make it yellow. There we go. And we're going to jug... I'll paint the top of this. There we go. Excellent. So now we actually need the, we the, the the plane to become smaller. I know that sounds weird, but we do. We need the plane to become smaller. So how do I make that look nice? Now, this is where I'm going to struggle. So there you go. All right, we're going to do this. There we go. We're going to we're going to actually do that, which might look a bit weird, but it's fine. We're also going to do this. Uh, which also might look a bit weird. Uh, because it's also going to come out pretty much the same. I don't know how to do this. All right, we'll do that to there. This is where things are going to get weird. All right, here we go. Do this down to there. Excellent. And seal it all off. It's a quick build, so it's not, like, amazing. But honestly, it should look, it should look okay doing this. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not very good at doing the rear of play. That's bad. That looks awful. That looks real bad, actually. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. No. I don't know how to do the rear of planes, turns out. How about we actually stretch out the bottom bit so it's quite long. All right, and we go from there. I think that's probably the best way of doing things here. So we actually do... Oh, I don't know. That, I guess. Yeah, we'll do this bit as well. There we go. It's extra long now. That works. And then we're just going to put these pieces on. And hopefully, hopefully, that looks brilliant. Yes, no, that looks awful. It, it looks too small is the problem. Because everything's a bit small on this aircraft. It is, it's a bit small. But if we did this, if we did this, and we actually had the rear of the aircraft be a bit taller than the rest of it, maybe, maybe that'll be okay, actually. Maybe it will. Who knows? Alright, so send this all the way backwards as well. Oh, this is going to be weird. This is going to be well weird. Alright, okay. There we go. Excellent. We're then going to attach this to here. Like that. There we go. Also very strange. Oh, that doesn't look good at all. It doesn't look good at all. No. Alright, we're going to do that. And then we're going to attach this guy to all of these, I guess. And we're going to seal that off. 
That looks very strange. Does it looks really weird, and I don't know how to feel about it. It looks very weird. Okay. Uh, we might be able to get away with this. We might be able to get away with this. Get rid of these guys. See a lot off there. Build ourselves a thing on here, and we'll go from there. All right, here we go. So, put that there. Excellent. We obviously need a tail fin thing going on. So, we're going to do this straight up. Excellent. Actually, maybe even keep that. Delete these guys. Fill this in as we go. Yeah, and then we need a control surface on the rear. I don't know if this is going to look good in the end. I'm going to assume probably not, but let's see. All right, and then we're going to do this. Actually, we're going to do this, and then we're going to do this. There we go. And honestly, that doesn't look too bad, to be honest. In fact, let's do it a little bit bigger. Usually these things are quite big. So, yeah, we're going to do it bigger. Here we go. Bam, 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 bam. All right, what do you guys think of that? Looks a bit weird. It's fine. It's okay. So, we're also going to build off of this, this way. So, we're going to go two, then two, then two, and that's it. There we go. So, this is going to go off here. There we go. Excellent. And we're actually just going to use rudders for these. I think that'll be fine. Rudder. Here we go. Clearly going to be exactly the same as each other, so I think that's fine. Uh, and honestly, I think that works. There we go. We're going to do that, and we're going to do this. Yeah, a little bit of rounding off. Excellent. So on in, what does it look like? <laughs> Looks like a banana. Guys, I've built a banana. Excellent. So now we need the upper wing. So I'm going to design the upper wing exactly the same as this. Okay. Now you might be thinking, what do you mean exactly the same? I mean it. Uh, <laughs> I mean it exactly the same as this. There. Okay. We're also then going to do this, which might be a bit weird to you guys, but there you go. Some little strut thing in my bobbies. And then we're going to build it in the middle as well. There we go. Very good. We're going to build this section in. There we go. And we're going to build this section in. And I think that's all fine, to be honest. Yeah. Okay, excellent. We're then going to delete these two. Now, you might not be n not know where I'm going with this, but I need a pivot. Yeah, robotic pivot. Uh, put it there. Yes, except I want it painting in like all the places if I can paint that bit paint that bit and paint This this bit this bit that I can see is bright yellow Is it done it, it looks like it's done it all right excellent So this needs merging with that before we do anything else. All right merge there we go then delete all of this get ourselves some pipes and We're gonna attach them on to here. There we go. And we're going to angle it backwards. Because that's how it works. So we need a number. And we need it to angle backwards. And that's it. I don't have an engine yet. That's probably an issue that. It is probably a bit of an issue. I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright. Connect the number up. And see where it goes from there. Here we go. Number, number. Make it very, very slight. Like 0.1. And see what happens. Unlimited electricity. Let's go. A wing fell off. Oh, that's not good. That that doesn't seem too good, to be honest. Doesn't doesn't really seem too good. But there we go. We got some pipe things going. Brilliant. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. This this looking. This looking like it might work, guys. Looking like it might work. All right. Rope. So instead of actually adding like solid bits for the next bit, we're just going to add rope anchors everywhere and that's going to be our um, thing. <laughs> yeah, rope anchors everywhere and that's going to be our thing. Hopefully that's okay with you guys. Ready? So that's going to go there. It's also going to go here. Like that. We're going to do another one right there. And also in the same place, right about there. There we go. So these are actually going to be crossed over because that's the way it should work, I think. So that's going to go there. It's going to go there. It's going to go there. This is going to go here. We need some rope anchors somewhere else as well. Probably this bit right here, actually. There we go. And we're going to paint this this color. And we're going to attach these guys to here. Let's go see what this looks like. Might look like a mess. Might not. I don't think that works. It does look too small. Like the entire plane, it, it does look a bit small. And I kind of feel like the uh, the wing on the top should be brought down. 
So we might do that, actually. Delete these two. Bring the wings down. Let's go. Who would have thought it'd be this easy to bring wings down? All right, there we go. Bring it down two. Cut it. Move it down one. Paste it. Attach this bit to that bit. Merge this with this. Delete these two. What's that? Oh, I didn't grab these two. Oh, that's annoying. Grab this one and this one. Cut it. Move it down. Paste it. Merge it. Hey! There we go. All right, spawn it in. Let's see what it looks like. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. I think that's fine. Okay. Kind of want these to be bigger. A little bit. So, bigger. Um, I guess the only thing we've got that's bigger is actually wedges that are this big. But that seems way too big. However, if I deleted this and we did this instead, maybe that's fine. Ooh. Yeah. No, that does seem okay. All right. We're going to do it here as well. There we go. Yeah. Much bigger wing things. Yeah. I think that's fine. All right. Let's go. Awesome. Nice. Guys, it's totally going to work. I don't know how big the wings should be sideways, though. Still still a little tiny bit confused about that. Not sure how big they should be sideways. It's probably fine. It's probably okay. All right. In fact, actually, make the top one a little bit longer than the bottom one. Probably by about four. I was going to say three, but it's fine. There we go. In fact, yeah, let's say three. And we'll round them off on the edges. There we go. Round this one off as well. And this one as well. Bam. There you go. So that's rounded. So let's do these bits. There we go. That bit. And this bit. Excellent. No, that's looking... That's looking all right, I think. Yeah. Considering it's only been, what, like 16 minutes? This isn't too bad. Can we fit an engine in there? <laughs> I was going to try and build a, uh, a thingy engine. Like a... What do we call it? Engine. Um, but then... Time and stuff. I think it would be very difficult to do that. Um, so, yeah. But if I move this all the way backwards to there... No. What if the engine was in the back? I know that sounds really weird and dumb, but... We could do that. Because then we'd have all the space and stuff for it. We'd be able to have coolant, exhaust, air... We'd be able to have everything for it, except it would be in the back. Which would be ridiculous. But would it be ridiculous? I don't know. Uh, guys, would it be ridiculous to have the engine in the rear? Probably. Let's move this out of the way and we'll do it. Alright, cut this. Move it forwards. We'll actually just have this right about there. Merge it in. Voila! Alright, good. Engine's going in the rear. Da, 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 da. Boop. There we go. Actually, no, wait. We'll have it go like this. Yeah, there we go. Right, so air supply can go literally straight through the floor. Uh, exhaust can go out the side. Fuel can be in the back. That's fine. And coolant can actually go in the roof. Yeah. Coolant could go in the roof. It totally can, actually. That's weird. All right. So, heat. Heat radiator thingamabobby. Electric radiator. Bam. Whack that on there. It's a bit weird. I know. It's fine, though. There you go. So, pipe this in. Let's do it. Here we go. Pipes. Bam. Excellent. Fuel, exhaust. Exhaust is different to fuel, so we're just going to go ahead and whack that out the side. Uh, it's weird that it's coming out the back, but whatever. It's a new plane. <laughs> Here we go. Exhaust is going to come out of there. Sideways. Excellent. Uh, our air supply is actually going to go out the bottom. So attach that straight up. There we go. And the amount of fuel we have doesn't have to be an awful lot, to be fair. But uh, let's, let's see. So the fuel tank, we could build a custom one and have it be the whole back area. Maybe not a bad idea, but also weight issues are probably going to be a thing. Let's do it. <laughs> Just, let's do it. Right, so fluid. We need a spawner. We need a meter. Meter right here. Spawner is probably part of this one. There we go. Excellent. So that's everything that we need back there. We're then going to go below it. Delete this all the way to the front. So about there. Excellent. We're then going to have it come up and into there. Gearbox, probably going to need one. Like that, there we go, excellent. I actually know the other way around, like this, good. We're going to get a pipe. We're going to bring it this way. We might need to add a bunch of weight in the front, by the way. There's literally no weight here, so it's probably an issue, but whatever. Okay, here we go. Angle it backwards, excellent. Angle this one forwards, and then attach them together via a big, long, straight pipe. 
Excellent. Guys, I'm very happy with this. Very, very happy. Uh, I'm going to paint the insides like this military green. I always do it. This weird, weird color green. Um, not the seats, though. Don't want the seats to be that color. In fact, let's jug the bottom. Let's jug the wings. Jug this bit, jug this bit. Excellent. It's done all the interior. That's fine. We're then going to, whoa, undo this. Paint that bit. Jug it. There we go. Jug that bit. Excellent. Yeah. Nice. All right. So we now have a plane. It has an engine in it. Doesn't have any floats. Doesn't have... I think the wings need to be longer. But other than that, I'm somewhat happy with it. Even though it looks really dumb. It looks really dumb. But let's sit in it and see what we think. Yeah, this works. Oh, this totally works. Brilliant. Okay, so. Um, oh, what? Seal off the front. That's fine. Paint the floor, because I wanted the floor painted this color. There we go. Paint that bit and that bit. And any other bits I can see? This bit and also this bit. There we go. I don't know why that wasn't... Oh, it's not painted back here either. Bruh. No. All right, there we go. Paint all of those. Excellent. So, we got it all painted in. We got ourselves a plane. I like it. What do we do now? What do we actually do now? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to paint this bit like so. Gives a little bit of a pizzazz. I don't know. I could be completely wrong. In fact, I do feel like I'm completely wrong after looking at it. But I'm sure it's fine. There you go. Do all of that. Do all of that. Excellent. Right, okay. The pizzazz is there, but it's wrong. Yikesies. Yikesies. Right. We need floats. We need the wings to be bigger. And then that's it, I think. So let's make the wings bigger via grabbing this piece all the way to there. We're going to grab the wings down to here. We're going to cut them. And we're going to move them out. Three. There we go. That seems about right, to be honest. So now we go to the other side. We grab the same amount. We cut it. One, two, three. We paste them back in. We then come across a little bit. Hang on. We only grab three. We copy them. Paste them in the holes. There's three and... There's three. And we merge it together. Excellent. Who would have thunked it? Our plane has big old wings. That's brilliant. Alright, so now we need some floaties underneath the wings. Uh, this is where things get very weird, I guess. So that goes down. This goes down. Probably about two. We need this to happen on both sides because we need it to be the same. So there and also there. Two. Excellent. Landing. We're going to use the default floats. I know that sounds weird and ridiculous, but it is what we are going to do. So there we go. All right, delete these two. Default floats are in. Excellent. Now we just need the big banana thing in the middle, and then we can go from there. However, <laughs> this is where the problem comes in. All of our weight is in the rear, okay? The big banana thing actually pops out the front because the engine's in the front and all the weight's in the front. So it's a bit ridiculous adding that, but I guess we're going to have to. So it's added via some sticks. <laughs> I like how descriptive I am. It's added via some sticks. I I'm not being wrong there, but I I'm not being amazingly good with descriptive words and stuff. Uh, we're going to drop this down by like this much. And we're going to build it on there. So send this backwards. Not very far. That's good. Send it forwards. Also not amazingly far. That's probably fine. We're going to do this on the front. One, two. There we go. We're then going to do this. There we go. And then we're going to finally finish off with like one of these. There we go. Excellent. Then we're going to do this. And then we're going to grab these guys. Send it straight up from there. And... The, that'll do... Kind of, I guess. The float will be big. I don't know. It's Stormworks. The float's always got to be big. It's got to be huge. So that's probably fine. Except delete this. And we'll have it... We'll have it go a little bit further forward. So cut that. Bring it forwards. Paste it there. Um, build this in from here to there. Merge it. Excellent. That works. I think I'm happy with that. Looks a bit weird, but I think it'll be fine. 
So, now we just add it so that it's a full thing. Okay, excellent. And that should be fine. There we go. We'll go up a little bit on the sides. We now need to go to other bits, like these ones. And put that in there. Yeah, probably, probably fine. There we go. Excellent. Build this one in as well. Yep. And finally, these bits. There we go. All right. That's uh, actually very nice. Very nice indeed. It looks a bit wide. It does look a bit wide. Let's delete a bit of this. Hey, there we go. All right, seal it off. Let's go. The banana boat thingamabobby is is gonna work. There we go. Excellent. In fact, actually, the top piece. We're gonna replace this bit with this bit, and we're gonna do this. Meow. There we go. That totally works. It's fine. All right, we're then gonna bring this backwards like so. There's a hell of a lot that this small engine actually has to lift up now, but. Probably fine. It's probably okay. Um, da, 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 da. Grab this. Send it up sideways to there. Delete these guys. Send this bit up sideways. Delete this. Send this bit up as well. Actually, no. Just delete those. I don't know how I want this to work. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, just grab this. Send it backwards to there. It's probably fine. I think. Bam. There we go. Bit of a weird back end on it, but that's okay. Seal all this bit off as well, if at all possible, which it is. There we go. And seal off the rest of it, and hopefully we're good to go from there. Alright, there we go. Remember, I haven't really counted for weight distribution or anything like that. We've literally just got a plane that should work. Right, wheels. This is where things get a little bit more interesting. We're going to add some big old bulky wheels. To the bottom at the rear, I guess, yeah. And we're going to try and push this into the water. Ridiculous, I know, but let's see. There we go. We need, like, a bit of a toe, but we should be able to just push it. All right, actually, let's start the rest of it first. So what we can do is we can just do A and D as roll. We won't have any roll to begin with. That's somewhat normal, I think. Uh, up and down is going to be for throttle. W and S is going to be for pitch, and A and D, no, left and right is going to be for uh, your. That's all A-OK. -okay. All right, good. Connect all of these to each other. I'm just going to connect them all to the same thing. You shouldn't do that, but there you go. Uh, we're going to make this thing. Um, yeah, three to one. That's probably fine. And we're also going to start the engine by pressing one. Bam. We're also just going to press two to start this thing. And honestly, that's probably A-OK. -okay. The brakes... Three? Yeah. Yeah, why not? Okay, we're good. We're good to go. We need a battery. That's the last thing. A little battery. A little small one. Put it in the front. Why not? There we go. We got loads of room. We might as well put a bunch of batteries in here, actually. But there you go. Attach that to uh, the thingy my bobby. And let's go. We might be able to take off straight away like this, actually, but we'll see. So jump up, jump in, press one. Okay, do we float is another question. Uh, also, are these full of anything? No, they're just empty. All right, we're going to add some pivots. Uh, and they're actually going to go in here. Here we go. So pivot, pivot, uh, pivot, pivot. There we go. So that we definitely float. Or maybe. Maybe definitely float. All right, let's go. Heave! You ever built a plane that you just wanted to push into the water so much that you just do? Yeah. Think about it. How crazy is that? I'm pushing my own plane into the water. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Also, my pitch was inverted, but I'm sure it's fine. We'll probably be able to fly like that. All right, let's go. Push it down. Push it down the hill. I thought as soon as we got to the hill, it would just slide, but no. Apparently, it needs more pushing. There we go. It's going. It's not. It's going. It's going. It's going. It's it's still going. It's still go. What's that? We got a rope anchor here? Wow, that's crazy. All right, okay. Jump in. Press one. Throttle up a little bit. All right, do we float? Not really. 
float plane storm works. Doesn't doesn't work. I don't think I've got enough pa Oh wait, my air supply's underwater. Um yeah, float planes and stormworks don't usually work, but also the whole fact that um my air supply went underwater, obviously a bad thing. Uh but then the worst thing is literally just hang on. The whole fact that um I've got my engine in the back of my plane. It might fly, but I I highly doubt it. So yeah. Anyway, let's try and take off one more time. Let's go. So jump in. Press one. I'm trying to turn it, but it's not not really letting me. All right, there we go. If we just push it in the right direction, press one, floor it. Let's go. Brilliant. Exactly what we wanted. No, that was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. Why did it just flip over like that? All right, point in the right direction. There you go. Jump in and go. Once again. There we go. So I'm not trying to take off here. I'm trying to get it to the water. That's what I'm trying to do. It is bouncing a little bit. All right, here we go. We're going on the downhill. We need to force it past this. We're about to crash into a rock. It's obviously not good. The downside of quick build videos, eh? They don't work. <laughs> All right, push it in. Let's go. I think I need to move the engine. It's a big, big failure point. Ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. What is wrong with me? Okay, right. What if we just had wheels? Delete these. Wheels. Okay, what if we just had like little, little wheels? Well, kind of like these ones. All right, I don't know whether they touch the floor. Probably not. Um, how do I build these in? All right, just delete that and, and probably that. There we go. And put little wheels on. Little fives. Little tiny. There we go. Little fives. It's not going to hold it properly. But once we start moving forwards, it might. All right, push it in the right direction. There we go. What if it was just a normal plane? Who knows? All right, here we go. This is, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Unbelievable. All right, okay. It's because we have so much weight in the front as well, which it, it's so odd. We've got so much weight in the front. We've got a hell of a lot of weight in the back, but the front is being the problem and the back is not being the problem, which doesn't make any sense. But there you go. So we're going to just whack some weight on here uh, because that's our problem, right? Yeah, look at that. More weight. Ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. All right, let's go. I give up. Guys. Guys. I give up. Why did I do this? Why am I doing this to myself? Why am I doing this to myself? So I think the base of the plane actually seems okay. It's just the engine in the back is obviously a really bad idea. Uh, we'll save this as we have it. All right, so save it as whatever. By plane thing. All right, there we go. And then we're going to delete all of this. This is going to be a very long video. Sorry. It's definitely unedited as well. I'm sorry about that also. But we're going to delete all of this. There we go. Delete all of this. There we go. Delete all of that. Yay. There we go. We just spent ages building this. That's fine. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. You know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Delete all of that. There we go. Wheels. Yeah. Now we need wheels. Okay, so... For wheels, we're just going to do this. We're going to go forwards from here. Just like so. We're going to add a block. We're going to go in one block. We're going to delete this block. We're going to go to wheel. Uh, we're going to get a 5x5. Five five. Yeah, pretty big ones. And then we're going to get some rear ones. Or a rear one, I should say. I have to dodge the... Uh, I have to dodge that. That's annoying. All right, we're going to get a rear wheel, um, which is actually going to go in the middle, which makes no sense, but but yeah. So the wheel actually, hmm, maybe we could go with one of these. Hang on. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah. Mm. 
I don't know whether that counts, but we're going to go with it. Right, let's go. Do you count? Do you count? Who knows? Jump in. Let's go. All right, I've got no roll, remember? I've got literally no roll. So that's an issue. But we took off. So I'm happy with that. <laughs> we got no roll. I took off. I'm happy with it. All right, one second. We'll add a little bit of roll, and then we'll see if we can still fly. Also, I'm going to fix the elevators because they're currently upside down. So grab this. Grab this one. Cut it. Flip it. Turn it around. Paste it. Merge it. Good. Bam. All right. Um, da -da 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 right. These are going to go on here. We're going to put them there. There we go. Excellent. The other one is going to be here, but the opposite. Bam. Excellent as well. We're then going to go to this. We're going to attach them to there. We're going to attach this one to here. We're going to do this uh, to A and D, and this to A and D. Excellent. Go. <laughs> Unedited. Unedited, guys. All right, let's go. In we get. Press 1. Throttle up. Turn the throttle engine ignition off. We're flying somewhat stably, stably, and uh, we're in the air. All right, I'm happy with that. Quick build video over.